Hello, this is Greg Fisher. Oh, I'm standing here at the bridge. It's kind of like the bridge between 2011 and 2012. Because this is the last day of 2011, and tomorrow will be the first day of 2012. Kind of really looking forward to it. And man, the stuff I'm reading on Facebook and on the internet and my email box. It's jammed with stuff warning me about 2012. I guess it's going to be like a real blast. I mean, what with this solar flare thing and erupting from the sun and the end of the Mayan calendar and electronic stuff. I mean, you know, electrons crowding the poles and the magnetic shift in the earth and all that. Wow, I'm getting prepared. Because I don't want it. I don't want anything to happen to the brain. You know, when all of this is going on, I'm going to be sure that I survive for 2012. Of course, I don't know what I'm going to do about uh, the shifting of the Earth's crust and all the other stuff that goes along with it. But I'm going to be prepared. Hey, isn't it crazy? The kinds of things that people are trying to put their trust and their interest in. Let me tell you something. The year 2012 can be a great year for you, not a year of disaster. You know why I know that? I know it because God created you for and with a purpose. You have an eternal destiny. I'll tell you something else. Margaret and I have learned that basing our life on the eternal Word of God is much more effective than basing our lives on the speculations of someone like Nostradamus. We'd like to invite you to join us on Sunday evening at 7 o'clock p.m. Mountain Standard Time. Now, you have to calculate what time that is in your time zone. But 7 o'clock p.m. Mountain Standard Time. Sunday evening, second half Christians. And if you look at the little lettering at the bottom of this screen, you'll see the website where we broadcast our Christian radio talk radio show. We'd like you to be a part of it. As Margaret and I are going to talk about hope and we're going to talk about things that could be better for you. So join us at 7 o'clock p.m. Sunday evening on Second Half Christians.